In this video, we'll write the formula for MnCH3COO2. Note that sometimes you'll see this acetate ion, this CH3COO, the whole thing has a charge of one minus. Sometimes you'll see it written like this. It's the same thing, it's just rearranged a little bit differently. So in this video, let's use the one on top, the CH3COO minus for the acetate ion. So we write the name of the metal as it appears on the periodic table. That's the manganese. So we just write manganese. Then we'll write the name for the polyatomic ion. So you either remember that CH3COO1- minus is the acetate ion, or if you're allowed, you look it up. So we're going to write the acetate ion. And then because manganese is a transition metal, we need to write the charge here between the names. So we know the acetate ion, the whole thing is 1-, minus, and we have two of them. 2 times 1 minus, that's 2 minus. The manganese has to be 2 plus. So we call this manganese 2, we have our Roman numeral here in parentheses, acetate. If you were given this name here, manganese 2 acetate, and asked to write the formula, the 2 would tell you that you'd have a 2 plus on the manganese, so you'd need to have two of these acetate ions for the charge to add up to zero. This is Dr. B with the name for MnCH3COO2, and sometimes you'll also see it written this way. Thanks for watching.